Kikuchi, so we're underway. And Taylor Ward sucks one to left. Alvarez won't even turn around. It is long gone to lead off the game for Taylor Ward, his 25th home run. And he continues to crush the baseball in the month of September. That ball was hit. Caratini, who struck out on a slider his last time up. Here's the 2-2 to Caratini. And he muscles one. Shallow right field, base hit. A 2-2 knock, an RBI, and we're tied. Just fought it off. Yeah, an inside-out swing. Go-ahead run at third. Diaz at second. Caratini at first. 1-1 one, one game. Two outs, bottom of the eight. John Singleton, one for three with an infield hit. In the left center field. Dying quickly. Down for a hit. Two-run score. Big John with a go-ahead double with two strikes and two outs of the eight. That is the mistake the Astros have. Angels are down to their final out. And that's lifted out in the left center, racing in Hayward, going out. Pena Hayward dives. He caught it. And that is the ball game. Houston Astros take game one from the Los Angeles Angels, winning tonight 3-1 to one and lowering their magic number. Case is loaded, one out. Dubon sends one to left. This will be deep enough to score Yiner Diaz. He'll tag at third. The throw will come in late. As the second baseman. There it is. Base hit. RBI. We're tied up. Jack Lopez with an RBI single. It's the bottom of the lineup. The balance. 1-1 one, one ball game with the runner on first. This one's hit well to center. Back on it. Pilar. Out of room or not? He is out of room. Home run, Alex Bregman. 3-1 Astros on Greggy's 24th home run of the year. Alex Bregman getting deep into the salsa jar on that one. 421 to Myers pick up a couple of RBIs with a single here. Jake throws one deep to left field all the way back. That ball's off the top of the wall. Two run score. Astros lead five to one. And now they're signaling home run. Three run home run. Jake Myers. Astros lead six to one. Eventually giving the home run signal for Jake Myers. Ups, runner goes again. That's going to be a stolen base for KP, Kevin Pillar. The 11th of the season. That's going to be a base hit to right field. Pillar's going to be sent. And Wagaman's going to pick up an RBI. Pillar scores at 6-2. to two. Matty Theis sat the dish. 1-2. That's ripped to right field. Okay, he needed it. He got it. Wagaman's going first to third. As Theis snaps out of an 0 for 34. Now that feels good. Two outs. Well inside. It Hit got him. him. It got him. Bases are loaded. Jack Lopez is the batter. Bases loaded. Two outs. Here's the 2-2. Two -two. Oh, get through. Get through. Oh, Pena makes a play, but he's unable to throw the baseball. Run comes in. Bregman with a two-run home run his last time up. Alex with a ball into center field for a base hit. Astros take a 7-3 lead. How about Tuck going first to third? Yiner Diaz still nobody out in the inning. There you go. There's the RBI he's been waiting for. Yiner Diaz, a single to center field, makes it an 8-3 to three game. Facing Matt Theis. Ice with the base hit up the middle. That scores one. And here comes Wagaman. The throw to the plate. It's off the mound. And two runs come in. It's 8-6. to six. Two RBI and another. Angles two runs scored. Tucker hits one pretty well to right field. Campero will watch this one go. Four for four for King Tuck. And he crowns the night with a home run. All hail the king back in his castle. And Hector Nera is still in there. And of course, Pilar leads off with the home run. Make the catch and go deep, big guy. His eighth home run of the season, seventh. His career, 37 is his career high back in 2019, 34 in 21, both with the Brewers, 33 last year. Tonight he's looking for his 33rd save. If Kyle Tucker has room, he'll have it. Tuck puts it away. A four-hit night for Tuck and save number 33 for Josh Hader. The magic number reduced to four as the Astros maintain a five-game lead in the AL West. Last night had four hits, including a home run. Ended up four for five. This one down the right field line. That's down for a hit. That'll be an RBI double. Tucker drives in Jordan Alvarez. As they trade places at second base, it's a 1-0 Astros lead. Four for bat going. He's had five at bats in this series, and they've all been strikeouts. As Ohapi drills one out toward left, toward the Crawford boxes, and that ball is off the top of the wall in left field. Moniak hits for third wow. base, and now the ball is slipped out of the hands of Dubon. Moniak comes home and scores.
Kind of short on that throw. A blooper reel from Dubon and left, and the Angels strike up a run. They tie the game 1 1. Time for Altuve to break out right here. Altuve sends one into shallow center, coming on Moniak. He won't be able to get there. Another ball that finds its way to the grass of the outfield. Astros just dinking and dunking lead this game 2 to 1. Just body shot after body shot. Field, and we're going station to station. And now Jordan grounds one to second, could be a double play, and is. So Jordan won't be credited with an RBI. The Astros score to run in that second inning. Astros looking to tack on to this 3-1 lead here in the third. That ball down the line, hit well to left field, all the way back and gone! Caratini just reached out and ends up with a three-run home run at 6-1 Astros. Woo. You know I like it. Alvarez comes to the plate now with the runner on first. Altuve taking off well before the delivery, and Jordan just punches it into center field. Altuve's going to get to third easily, and the ball's misplayed by Mickey Moniak, and Altuve will score. Jordan just punched the ball into left center field with Altuve running, and the Astros get a run off. And one out. Dubon line drive single into center field. Everybody will move up a base. And the Astros lead 8-2. to two. Dubon drives in his 40. He hits tonight. He's 3 for 4. Jordan hits one to center. Did he ever hit one to center? Off the top. It's out. Jordan hits number 35 on the year as he crushes one. Jordan. Oh, to man. Deep to right field. Hooking. Fair ball. King tuck. Four hits and a home run. Whatever you can do, I can do as well. Strike and what's left of this sellout crowd of more than 40,000 rises. Pitch is strike three call at the top of the zone. Stefanik goes down looking and that is the ball game. The Houston Astros with a season high 20 hits as they beat the Angels 10 to four. Astros magic number to win the AL West. Is For Alex Bregman, nobody out. And he pops the first one up. Shallow right field near the line tagging is Altuve he's going to try to score here comes a throw by Campero and Altuve safe that'll be a sack fly for they walked and scored the only run in the game for the Astros in the third inning Altuve drives one high and deep to left field making a bid for home run number 20 there it is a 2020 season for Jose Altuve third time in his career the Astros lead it two to nothing that might be the medicine the Astros need to cure the hangover from a 20 hit sack fly down the right field line his last time up driving in the game's first run. Bregman lines this one toward right center field. Campero racing back, still going back, looking up, and that is gone! Into the Astros' bullpen. A two-run shot for Alex Bregman and a 4-0 lead for the Astros. On his 25th home run of the year. Atta boy. Zach Neto, a couple of strikeouts today. There's a drive to left. Zach Neto crushes one beyond the Crawford boxes in left field. And the Angels get on the board here in the... And he does lift one out toward right center field. This one hit pretty well. Hayward is chasing. So is the center fielder. It's Myers who makes the catch. The tying run scores, advancing to second base, Campero. It's a long sack fly for Shonowell. The only blemish against Aragetti today in his six innings of work. It was a two-run home run. That ball's drilled out toward left center field. This one is gone! A home run! The Angels take the lead on Zach Neto's second home run of the game. Magneto magnificent. Back-to-back at-bats. Home runs. Now give him up. That's... He hits one into right center field. That's down for a hit. Campero will slide to cut it off. He drops the ball. Brightman's going to be waved around. Trying to score the tied run. We're tied at five. That's what I'm talking about. Shea Whitcomb. Haven't seen him in two weeks getting at bat. He's going to get an at bat here in the, one of the bigger spots of the year. Trying to give the Astros a lead. Whitcomb drops you. one to center field. <laughs> RBI base hit for Shea Whitcomb. The biggest swing of his. And two. And it's ball four to tie the game. Ward draws a bases loaded walk. Hader has blown the save. And it's six to six. What a battle here for the Halos. And now the quiet in the... And three RBIs has a chance to be the hero in the ninth. He grounds one. It's past Bregman. Down the left field line. Pilar scores. Shadowell scores. Here comes Taylor Ward. He scores. Six RBIs for Neto. And the Angels are up in the ninth. First.
Nakata before. And Yinder lifts this one in the center field. Moniak coming over. He'll play it on a bounce. And then it kicks away from him, recovers. Coming in to score Tucker over to third Bregman. It is 9 to 7. Angels. Yiner Diaz fights one off, and the Astros still have life. So now Victor Caratini, who had his first right hand hitting home run last night. There's a base hit. One run game. Yiner Diaz stops at second. Now Moniak bottles it. He'll head to third. It's 9 to 8. The Astros refuse to go away with two outs in the ninth. So Jeremy Pena. One for three with a walk today. Tying run at third, winning run Kessinger at first in the bottom half of the ninth. Got him. All game over. Astros down nine to eight today. They do not get the four-game sweep of the Angels. The Astros' magic number is 